Hello everyone and welcome to this video. In this video we're going to try and get Fallout 4 working with Vorpex in virtual reality. A little bit of work we have to do first so let's swap over to the desktop and get that out of the way before jumping in game to check out my in-game Vorpex settings. So navigate to your game installation directory. Mine's on a separate hard drive so it's going to be here, Fallout 4. And the Fallout 4 folder. And Fallout 4 prefs. We're going to want to edit this file but also in your my documents, my games, Fallout 4, Fallout 4. We're going to edit this file and this file as well. I'm not sure why there's two of these, so what we're going to do here is, if you've got two as well as me, we're going to edit both of them. So let's get all these opened. Okay, I've got all these files open now. My first instruction, we need to find the controls section. Controls right here. We're just going to add this line here. Same in the other one. Let's just look for the control section. There it is. Let's just add the line. And the last file. Interface controls right there. So that's B, mouse, acceleration, equals zero. In all three files in the controls section. Now look for the display section in all three files, which is here. So we're just going to add it at the bottom. In the next file, we're going to look for display again. Here it is. Add it at the bottom. Last file. Okay, so we've we've prepared the, all our files, all our game files now. So let's save all. Close all. We can minimize this. Let's start up our Oculus app. Let's start up Vorpex. Right click it and open Configure Vorpex. Go to Local Profiles, type in Fallout 4, right click, create a new profile based on this. OK. Now click Game Settings Optimizer, there it is. Do the same thing here, Fallout 4. Re you can read through this if you want. Um, we've just set our field of view to 120, so let's put that to the same. Screen resolution 1280 by 1024. Yeah, that's fine. Apply other tweaks. Okay, now optimize settings. Settings applied. Apply and close. Moment of truth. Now we're going to go into our Fallout 4 installation directory and give it a go. Let's get my headset on. Continue game. Confirm. Once you're in, just hit the middle mouse button when you're in the menus so you can uh, navigate all the menus and then press it again to get back into um, normal view. And we're in game. I think 120 degree, uh, field, 120 field of view is perfect. Everything looks real. It's jittery right now because I'm recording. Yeah, it's, it's perfect. It's perfect. I'm going to open up my in-game Vorpex settings now to show you those. It's always best to adjust them for your for your own comfort but you can take a look at mine pause the video on mine and get a general idea of what I'm using to help you choose the best settings so these are the main settings image settings head tracking settings And that's it. Thanks for checking out this video, guys. I hope you've ever liked it and it's helped you out. If it has, please give me a like. If not, give me a dislike and drop me a comment below. I always love to know what's going on with everyone. And if you have any recommendations, do let me know and I'll try and get a video up ASAP for you. Peace out, guys.